All right guys, I'm back home. I spent a little too much time in the Dollar Tree actually, but I am gonna show you a couple things. Um, something that does help me get through the fasting, sometimes if I'm having a really challenging day, I will do some dirty fasting. And if you need some major dirty fasting tips, go see Christy Davis on YouTube. She is the dirty fasting queen and she has tons of tips and awesome ideas to utilize. So. When you're trying to get through the fasting part, you can still consume some calories, but you want it to still be low fat, like zero fat, zero carb, and you want to keep it under 50 calories at a time. So I'm going to flip the camera around and I'm going to show you some options that I'm going to utilize. Okay, so my first lot here is sparkling ice. Oh, I'm waiting for that to focus a little bit here. So sparkling ice is pretty bomb. Look at that. Whoa, focus, focus, focus. Might need to better backdrop. I don't know. Oh my goodness, guys. What is going on? So look at that. Five calories for the entire bottle. Zero fat, carbs, all the things. This is great. And you can even turn this into something more fancy. You could add a little bit of heavy whipping cream and make it into a fun, tasty dessert kind of drink. But then again, you still need to be mindful of those carbs and the fat content and calories in the whipping cream. So, got some of these. So I got, yep, so the orange mango, black raspberry, and the cherry limeade. Those are good. Now my next one, and final one for this video, is just the sugar-free Jello cups. So, yep, there's four in a pack. Look at that right there. Whoop, focus, focus, focus. What is going on? Keto friendly, right there. One carb per serving. And they are five calories, zero fat per cup. Boom. So you can't go wrong. So you could easily have one of these mid morning and you can even have it with your drink and it would make, sometimes guys, it makes a world of difference. So check those out at your Dollar Tree. You can't go wrong. All right, guys, I'm gonna get started on making dinner. Uh, we have some other stuff going on this afternoon, so I need to prep early. It is only like 11.30 in the morning, so, but you know, time's a ticking. So I got up my Instant Pot, and I'm gonna be making some keto chili tonight. Um, just gonna chop up this onion really fine. You guys, if you don't have one of these, I just got this off of Amazon. It is the best. It comes with a bunch of different types of blades, different sizes, shapes, whatever you need. It literally chops my onion in a split second. I usually just cut it in half or quarters and then bloop, bloop, and everything comes out even, and it's fabulous. So, I'm gonna do that right now. There you go, see, watch. Super simple, watch this. Oh, of course. <laughs> Boom, done, here we go. It's almost like emerald. Ready? Bam! Here we go. So easy. Whoops, what am I doing? What am I doing? Done. So great. You know, I love using that thing too because I know like if I'm super tired and whatever else and I don't feel like my chopping skills are going to like, you know, really help me out. I'm going to lose some fingers. That is my game right there. So, all right. I'm going to saute that in some, a little bit of avocado oil with some onion and whatever else. I'm going to throw all my ingredients in the pot, set it and forget it. Super easy. I can serve that over a little bit of cauliflower rice, which I will and probably a little side salad. So that's gonna be dinner. My kids are gonna be having it with like some potato. <laughs> Sometimes I'm like, oh, but you know what? It's worth it. It's worth it in the end to really just get your health in gear. So, all right, let's move on. All right guys, lunch time. I'm gonna make myself a curry, chicken curry wrap. So I'm gonna use these egg wraps, zero net carbs, I think. Yeah, even 30 calories, one and a half grams of fat. So, pretty simple, pretty easy. It'll get the job done. So I have some leftover curry. Um, it doesn't look super appetizing because it's not warmed up and whatever else, but it's gonna be really good. And then I got some greens. I've got some, a little bit of cilantro. I'm gonna put a little bit of a um, cream sauce that I made at home here. 
uh, to go on top. So I'll show you what that looks like when I'm done. All right, there it is, guys. Nothing too fancy. I'm not going to put it on a plate or anything, but it's a little bit messy here, but I'm really going to enjoy this. It's going to be super filling, really delicious, savory, and I'm so happy to be breaking my fast with this. So I'm going to eat this one and maybe have another one after that, and then I'll be set till dinner. Mm -hmm.